Pokemon Day! No, that's the 27th of no uh, February. Sup, punks? Jay here, and welcome to the next episode of the Academy Challenge. Yes, we have come back for the bunny. Even though it's already been Easter. Right. Yeah, you kind of missed the mark a bit, didn't you, Jay? Oh well. I didn't miss the mark, the wheel did. Hope we get to spin it today. Right. Hmm. Bear with me here, folks. Indeed. Just gotta sort something out. There. And now let us make as the fire type sandwich. Obviously, this is going to be involved of the case of um yeah. We could bump into Chimchar instead of uh, Score Bunny. Yes, we were talking about Cyndaquil earlier before stream as well. You were telling me how very difficult that one is apparently going to be. So yes, it is. Is it any more? Is it any more difficult than the bunny? Oh no no no! By, not by a long shot. You'll see why in a minute. Oh, okay. We'll see. Mm. The I'm curious. It was just bad luck in the algorithm that did me in last week. I when mean, we get when we get onto Silver Quill, when we get onto Cinder Quill, it will be hell. We're gonna have to restart this sandwich. Oh. No. If one single ingredient falls off, it won't work. Ah. So I'd be astounded if it does work. Yeah, something definitely fell off. No. Right, uh, let's uh, get Stream Raiders going before someone rips through my screen. And yes, you know who I'm talking about. <laughs> Tori. Bombs? Texted Tori, we'll see what happens. Yep, didn't you work. Tori really likes Stream Raiders. <laughs> You've got to reset the entire. No! That's yeah, because it started a new I... event. And yeah. Ah. I needed to say Ooh. encounter on the bottom, not egg. That, that's how frustrating this, this met part is. Cherry tomatoes oh. are the worst. Sorry, cherry tomatoes. We we say it right. We're not Americans. <laughs> I mean, that can be pretty clear. Yeah, it's jolly good. We do drink tea. Elementary, my dear. In yes, case you... dear Watson. The game is afoot. The irony is of that. Um, not long ago, I just finished reading the first book of Sherlock Holmes. Didn't even know that was available. I thought it was one of those. Is that old? You can't read things. Actually, it's very legible. I quite enjoyed it. Um. Sneaky. Oh well. Hey, let's try that again. Yeah, so Arthur Conan Doyle, who's the writer of Sherlock Holmes, only died in 1913. That's late for him. Yeah, the, yeah, exactly. You would have thought he'd die closer to the Victorian era. Um, yeah, because everyone had a, everyone yeah, developed like asthma back. Yeah. Everyone had asthma back then. Yeah, again, World War One was 1914 to 1918. He died a good ten years after World War One. Jeez. 
Jesus. Finished. So yeah, he he was around. I don't even remember when did Tolkien die. The sandwich dump. Wouldn't that be like 90, 100 even? Yeah, so for instance, uh, Tolkien died in 1973. Um, he was born, so Tol Tolkien was born late Victorian era. Um, just as that, that's the other book I'm reading. I'm reading Lord of the Rings for the first time. Anyway, writers, <laughs> You you seen that um Disney film Basil the Great Mouse Detective? It rings a bell, yeah. It's literally oh, a mouse. It's, it's basic. It's of, yeah, it's one of those fever dream films, isn't it? It's literally if you put Sherlock Holmes into a mouse. Yes, yes, I'm remembering the one you're talking about now. And then Watson is conveniently named Dawson instead. Uh -uh. I know, I'd prefer Watson, but fine. Like doorstep mouse. I never clicked on that. They, they can, yeah, they can be sometimes called doorstep mouse, because they have holes in the doors. So yes, uh, as you can see, there are a lot of bunnies around. find him immediately, did you? No, he's no. red, I think. Though it, this isn't going to be another one of those that they're hard to spot. And I just came back from a from an optician's appointment. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, <laughs> I've just got a notification saying that Tori has just added something to the stream raiders. We will see what happens oh, there. They are, they are milling about. Mm. <laughs> Uh, they sent me a cat with just the word yes. Oh god damn it! The problem is the lighting as well, because obviously yellow and red are very bright colours. Yeah, it's, it's, but it's the rest of the bunny kind of blends in, and the issue is they're very small. They're very small bunnies. So you're way faster than them. So you're like kind of zooming past. That's that's the aim of the game, and also since yeah. um I didn't get score bunny on the first sandwich last time, that means we'll jump straight over to the next Pokemon, even if the sandwich is up. So yes, it's kind of a waste of a sandwich, but we've got a challenge to do, and it might open us up to a few more um ideas after it. Hmm. Well, good luck. I am. Um... Here spiritually, here spiritually, I'm actually physically here for once. Yeah. You know. yeah. I think, frankly, I'm just glad I can just talk to someone. The silence is the worst part of doing these. I'm not always available, dear, but I do try. I'm not saying you have to oh, be. No, no, no. I'd be better glad we've had this conversation before. Mm hmm. <laughs> I got bored. I'm just waiting. I, I, knowing Tori, I know she's. They said that they're busy on Saturdays, but I'm just waiting for them to just jump in the chat and then start talking. And then while we're just trying to find this thing, they just go, "Jay, Jay, stream readers, stream readers." <laughs> yeah. I mean, I mean, you should have seen. The, well, well, you did see the Discord mo mo yeah. notifications. Yeah. That's not a rabbit. That's a monkey. Ooh, ah. It's really common in Pokemon. Like every generation always has like a new monkey. Or at least a new ape type creature. I guess. Yeah, forever that way. Now think about it. How many generations of monkeys have there been? Well, if you count humans, then every generation. <laughs> uh, true. Good point. Well done. You caught me out there, sir. Nope. 
thing is, I'm technically looking for both of these guys. Because, mm. like, I won't say no to finding a chair job, but obviously we're here for score bunny. Indeed. Sometimes it's better when you just sort of tunnel vision anyway. Not if you're playing Widowmaker. I'm not an Overwatch player, you know this. And you never should. <laughs> I mean, at this point, yeah. Kind of feels like what it kind of feels like how people react to smoking. Like people who do it tell people never to do it, but they still do it. Yeah, like don't start because you know, ten years down the line, you'll be a thing and loser. Going to anger management class, getting scared about seeing cyborg ninjas coming into your face over and over again when it's just a guy in a fancy dress costume. I'm crazy. Such a different direction, Jay. I'm crazy. We, we've, stopped, we've stopped talking about Overwatch. Everything's about Overwatch. Hmm. <laughs> This do be intuitively different. <clears throat> oh, that's good. Another good tea. Another good tea. Another good case. Yes, you might as well fucking call me Alma Fudd at this point because it's the fucking wabbit season. <laughs> uh, oh, fucking hell. That. How, clo how close was that Alma Fudd left? Uh. Crowy, we don't need a continuity error. You like crows and only crows. <laughs> sure. Birds and only birds. And apparently not allowed to like any other animals. Uh, despite the fact that most, most of the times in Pokemon, they pick fire and electric. And the bird thing is only because I like birds. Um, but I don't particularly like flying types that much, but I just like birds. So, like, I will, very often when it comes to the starters of Pokemons, um, I will almost always pick fire unless there is a bird. That surprises me that you didn't pick Quarkovel then. Which generation was that? Which game was that from? Remind me. Nine. Nine. This what one I'm called? the one I'm playing now. I I picked the wait, that's ha. Ah, I picked the crop. Yes, but you had options to pick duck. Oh, yeah, I didn't like the design of the duck, that's a good point. So I because my brain kept thinking Quaxley. Thought well, that's it, that's the name right. Is it is that the name right? Is yeah. My brain is getting Pokemon confused. I was like, hang on, that's got to be Pokemon from a later generation. No, it's not. From an earlier generation. Jeez. Can't function. Pokemon does that to you. Sailing. Hmm. How much sound do I have on this sandwich? 
20 minutes, we're still good, but... And it's like Mike keeps saying it's the algorithm that's doing me in, because the shiny is admissible, it's just it hasn't shown up yet. Hmm. I agree. Alright, I'm setting off on a mission to see if I can find a shipwreck. Uh, so, for reference, anyone that is listening or watching later on, VODs or not, um, we, we've all agreed to buy, well the group have all agreed to buy Sea of Thieves for when uh, the beta is, you know, over and we can play normally. Uh, so I'm kind of getting uh, some practice here. I do honestly think Sea of Thieves could be a good game for us to play off camera as Almost well as on. Uh, yeah, I like, agree with you. The thing is, if we had different save files, I would say we'd have separate save files, one for stream, one for not, but we don't, so... Not quite how this works, unfortunately. We're gonna have to sod the idea of following along a story arc, because one, there isn't really one, unless we choose one, in which we can do in one stream, and two, yeah, it's just gonna Minecraft. be awkward. It's bit, that's why I'm saying it's gonna be like Minecraft, because it's gonna have a lot of content base to it, it's gonna have regular updates, and there's a lot to do. And I'm just going to say, if there is ever a situation where we are going to in, going into a proper fight against other players and we actually we win, that will be a big occasion. No, that will be a big occasion. No, no, you will be, to be fair. Please. If we actually we'll beat be. them. <laughs> That's not happening anytime soon. I'm not that good of a gamer. Also, plus it's noob killing season. Because the, the, the whole Sea of Thieves community is well aware of the new people coming in. So it's noob killing season. So we just have to survive noob killing season. That's going to take a couple months, but we've just got to get past that point in which, you know, everyone fall off. Um, so yeah, we, we shall see. I can always think about that one like Looney Tunes meme where it's just like duck season, wabby season, duck season, wabby season, whatever the person wants season. I just see Xbox and PC players just doing that and just seeing PS5. Oh, oh yes, I get what you mean. I remember that now. That took me a second for me to remember what that meme was. Um, that's Looney Tunes, right? Yes, it's Looney Tunes. Looney Tunes. Oh, folks! Are there any bunnies that like yellow hair dye around here? I'll even take a blonde one. That, that's the annoying thing about this. That, that that right there. When they run, because the ears are folded back and it's hard to see the colour of the ears. Oh, Lovely gonna be one of those streams again. Welcome to Pokemon Shiny Hunting. I'm gonna die. <laughs> and I'm the one who's playing Sea of Thieves. So Arguably sure the I'm more dangerous game. Running? Yes, I was gonna say, sure, 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 I'm not the one that's going to die. I still have a funny feeling that Mike's somehow gonna find a way to just say J so many times during that playthrough. So, uh, just gonna be J, J, J all over the time. That's explanatory, it's my. We should really actually get a toy to do an MO where it's just the letter J. No, it needs to be like a face that's unimpressed. 
Well, it's just Give Mike's face. Face. Or, or face palm. We're just gay. God dang it, Jackie Chan. No frenzy, I want to kill him too, but this is a fr family friendly game. Indeed. Frenzy still ain't, be ain't recovered after what um some what someone called uh, her the other day. <laughs> they got called Gliscor Rossi. <laughs> Wasn't that by Kira? No, but they reacted pretty. They pretty. They reacted pretty hard by it. <laughs> my brain. So I saw that clip, and my brain kept thinking James Bond, Octopussy. Oh Jesus Christ! I still don't know that, how they got away with a film like, title like that. That is a legitimate film title. It is. Very sad. This. Bond's name. Um, James' name. Pleasure. So what? Also, the irony of that film is, um, the title is terrible, but if I remember, it's one of the films of that era where the women are treated slightly bit better. Because there's, for once, a female, not, well, let's say, I want to say anti-hero, who can hold her own and tells James Bond to fuck off. I think. I could be wrong. Um, but it turns I out, um... Turns out the writer for James Bond was also fairly sexist, which is so sad. Well, that's the one thing I've never liked about the James Bond series. He's just a horny guy with a gun. Pretty much. I mean, the, new, the newer films are a lot better. He just wants to fuck one. any female he runs across. Pretty much. And what's exciting about a spy that does that? Thing. The whole point is a spy isn't meant to be, uh, what's the word? Um, discreet. Noticeable? Yeah, the spy's meant to be fairly discreet. They're not meant to be noticeable, but then, you know, he swans in with every girl on his arm. Hey, you know what they say, they don't come quietly. Apparently not. Well, at least you could see the dick a mile off. Literally. <laughs> mm hmm. Just trying not to. This isn't a try not to laugh challenge. We've already done that this year. <laughs> you liked my joke and I'm pleased. That's concerning. That is a ghost ship. No, thank you. That needs three shots to take down from your cannons. Three? Only three? That's interesting. Okay, thank you. Yay, my ship is taking damage. You need wood to repair it. Yes, I know. Is that? No. You know, it sounds like this, it makes me think. This game hates me. Because there's no other reason for the Pokemon to not show up by now. Ugh, I'll have a mess to go. Jeez, that was quick. I... okay, I don't understand how to deal with this. Tell me how... game! Tell me... my mast is broken and I don't know how to fix it. <laughs> oh, um, you know the ropes you use to turn them yeah you can pull them up yeah, using that just trying to do that but were you using the right one no idea we'll try the left we'll try the other one just in case well i'm dead my ship is probably in the ocean you didn't have any treasure did you no not really i well know, it's I wasn't not really on the treasure run anyway it's not the end of the world, then, if you haven't got any treasure. Because, again, you and your ship respawn, so... 
It's only a problem if people start camping where you've spawned. I'm, I am trying to do what you're telling me to, but it's not doing anything. It's not doing anything. Hmm. How mm. dare you? It's not the thingy angle, it's the... It's the raising it's, sail bit. It's the raising sail bit, yeah. That was not clear. Yeah, I admit it wasn't really. At this point, I'm just gonna grab all these stupid bunnies, dip their ears in yellow paint, and call it a day, and move on to the next morn. Throw it out the window. When did I say anything about throwing it out the window? Well, you, by the end of this, you're gonna want to throw one out the window. <laughs> So of all places, why would fire type sh sit on a frozen mountain? It's a good point. Maybe because they burn too hot. At least with torch it could hit in a cave, that made sense. It's exactly what happened with Drilba. Drilba didn't need to last that long. I am so totally sinking. And somehow I'm surviving for reference. But I would say you use that time to survive to um, get your water out of your boat. Yeah, I'm trying to, but they keep putting in holes before I can do anything. Mostly because I can't particularly concentrate. Maybe it might be an idea to quickly pop up to the sail, get them up, and then just make sure you're going forward while you're repairing. Yep, easier said than done. Didn't say it was easy, I'm just giving you the best case of advice. Yep. I think one of the scariest things about this is... What if I missed one? Come on, I did it again. Well, I got shot right in the face with a cannonball. That's a one shot. Yep. I'm trying! Seven minutes. Well, you know, mostly trying to find uh, shipwrecks, but I believe I've become one. Or, well, I'm in the process of becoming one. Well, that means you found one. If you've made one, that obviously means you found one at the same time. By technicality. <laughs> Jesus. Ugh. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Oh, they died. 
I survived. You survived? I survived! We'll repair your boat and get back to it. Yes, sir. We're not even playing. Um, that shows the authoritarian I have here. You versus Mike, we all both know who's going to be calling shots. It will be Mike. Yes, it will. Even though I'm the fucking captain. Yeah, he, he, he'll catch whenever I can't communicate. Well, if he does pull that trick, he will go on the brig. Even though we won't have a brig until the three-person ship. Oh, the brig's only in three-person ship. That's, that's why it's, that's why it's called the. That's why it's called the brigette. Oh, the brigette. The brigette's the second one. Galleon's the main. Uh, well, I have survived. I do need to sort out a few things about like if we could get away with a fourth person, because it wouldn't be fair asking Kira when they've got work. I doubt we can. I think we will only ever sometimes have three, and the majority of the time we will probably only at least have two. I can replenish my cannonballs. Helpful. No, I, I do think it'll be free. Yeah, I think so too. Um, but you never know. I might be a bit uh, oof. But it won't be the end of the world, though. That's the thing. Yeah, which is a good thing about this game. I will set up a guild, though. So hopefully anyone who watches us will join that. Yeah. Because, like, obviously the whole community thing is the idea of getting the viewers to play as well. Hmm. Like, imagine if we had a whole fleet of ships, and that is possible from what I've heard. Indeed. That would be very curious indeed. That would be a lot of fun. Have a whole endgame situation where we just charge into a battalion. Yeah. Oh. I doubt, but... Yeah, it's good to doubt, because that probably will never happen. That's a dream. It's such a dream. What, to actually have a functioning community? <laughs> we'll get there eventually. Yeah. Yeah, don't need the barrel. But that, that's the thing these with um, the content. We know it's working because people are subscribing to the channels. And we are think, seeing views. I think people watch the VODs after the fact. Um, always, always trying to make sure that the best bit videos are more accessible though. Mm. Agreed. Three minutes and then we have to do another fuck the second sandwich. Yeah. Very close. Let's go in where are we? Where are we? That's where we are. Oh monkey boy, hello, and you're marked. I found a shiny monkey! And it's a female monkey! A baby. It's a female monkey! It's a baby monkey! Go back, I want to be monkey! Ah, there you are, Tori. And yes, I will get started with it. I know why you're here. We shall evolve Chimchar first. Classic. Good old classic Pokemon right there. Actually, we'll ride out the sandwich just in case we get extra lucky with Squall Bunny. Which we have two minutes, so I need to start speeding up. But yes, we have Monkey. Which means we need to ignore the monkeys and focus on the godforsaken bunnies. I accidentally bumped into a sand shrew. Why is it called a sand shrew when it's not covered in sand anymore? Why is it always sand shrews? 
Shouldn't it be called? All the time. I always bump into those. Shouldn't it also be? Shouldn't it, shouldn't it only be called Snowshrew? Technically. But they're, they made all the different variants confusing. Oh no, it's not Mankey, it's Chimchar Tori. I have I not taught you anything in the art of Pokemon names? Mankey is a different Pokemon entirely. I don't like him as much. Chimchar's a classic. Annihilate is cool though. Extremely cool. You know, I've got like a love-hate relationship with this challenge, I'm not gonna lie, because it's like, Yeah! Shiny! Shit! More editing! <laughs> Good point. Oh my god, is that another ship? Is it another no, ship? No, it's not. Yeah. No, it's not. I'm thinking it goes. Alright, the sandwich is up. Alright, let's get the monkey out. I tried. But we shall try again. But the important thing is we did knock something off the list today. That's the first of the Sinnoh starters we've got. First off, let us sever. Sava Mercy. Let's have a look at this one. What mark does it have? The snowy mark! Jim Char the Snow Frolicker. That's cute. And it will be the first edition of our new box, considering we filled up the first one. Oh, that is another ship. How big is it? Is it like a, sl a sloop or a galleon? I don't know, it's a full size. Okay, let's evolve Chimcha. Muck Punch. The single best move this thing can learn. And then finally, Monferno. To Infernape! That's it. Hmm, the flames on Infernape look interesting. Close combat. Uh, no, that's good. Infernape the Snow Frolicker. N nice. A job well done. Well done. Now let's get back onto the stupid wabbit. Wabbit. You have to excuse me, I'm trying to adjust my new glasses. Oof, the days of tie-in movie games. Oh, before I do that, it is time. But I don't like it when Sea of Thieves does a musical sting. Give me a reason, game. Why? I don't see anything. Let the battle begin. Now it's gone dead quiet again.
Tori's in the lead for kills and assists. And Tori wins the first one, even though they were the only person here. Simba. Bronze handball shinobi skin. No idea what that is. Let's ignore that. You happy now, Tori? We got Stream Raiders back up for you. <sighs> rabbits, 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 rabbits. I feel like I'm in that Wallace and Gromit film. Sandwich, but then once you do the sandwich, I need to run an advert, okay? I frankly wouldn't mind as long, <clears throat> unless the shiny pops up, obviously. Which would be extremely bad timing. It would be for knowing us. It will. Indeed. I'm pretty sure it's happened before. I think it did it by accident one time when you were on your own, like, the um, advert activated on its own and I found it. <laughs> Sorry about that, I had an internet issue. Oh, don't, don't even worry about it, that's uncontrollable. Trust me. God, I don't know why I'm so f stressed, I don't know why I'm so stressed out. Oh no, he's fine. That that what? animation, man. Oh, what was it... that animation? He's Those... so unhappy, and then all of a sudden. Those in Herba Mystica kind of attribute yeah. a specific taste, you know, like sweet, salty, bitter, all that. Right. Yeah. It, basically, how you'd react to different types of taste. Right. That's what it is. Can you tell I haven't played this game yet? We need to get you at least Legends Arceus or Sword and Shield. Just something Pokemon related so you can keep Sword and she uh, Scarlet and Violet in the back line. Or oh, I play Scarlet and Violet and then we keep one of the other Pokemon games in the back. Well, uh, that's what I'm saying though, because... Um, right now I st I'm just trying to finish Baldur's Gate, but it takes bloody forever. It's, it's a very long game. Well, I, I think... cannot focus on more than one thing at a time. I think Scarlet and Violet. Scarlet and Violet. No, sorry. Legends Arceus yeah. is that is the one outlier of the series because like it's not like yeah. the others, and I'm sure you know that. It's set in a completely different time period. Uh, I need to run that advert. I completely forgot. Oh <laughs> God, sorry. I got distracted by our conversation. In Conversation Street. Um. Just a mental note, uh, Mr. Richard Hammond, uh, if you, uh, if uh, I am getting into trouble for saying your famous phrase whilst uh, you were on the Grand Tour, I apologise. I will retract the comment if there is a problem. There's a good chance there isn't a problem, but I'm just double checking. Okay. I'm surrounded by monkeys and bunnies. You okay, Tori? They will probably be in advert land. 
Either that or they're at that Discord session that they told me that that's what they do every Saturday night. Well, Saturday afternoon for them. D &D? Is it D&D for them again? Yeah, they, they have D&D at the same time that I do. Or at least on the same day. Just making sure that all my mods are in tip-top condition. Which we're all not, but we'll just try and pretend. D&D <laughs> &D therapy. Imagine that, just Dungeons and Dragons, but it's treated like a therapy session. Roll, roll for confidence. Shit, I got a one. Roll for confidence. Like, guess I got a nat natural one. Great. <laughs> we didn't have D and D today since our DM is not feeling up for it. Aww, I did. It went well. We uh, had a portal where there were tons of demons coming through. And we closed the portal. That's just Discord notifications asking you to talk. <laughs> yes, because I am a demon to the world. Continue to make sure I don't crash my ship. I've been trying to find shipwrecks, but I can't find any. I do want to say that I do feel guilty for leaving Tori out, but again, I get that it's the whole motion sickness thing, but it just doesn't feel fair. Well, you're welcome to join if you want to on the left. I'm not saying anything particular, it's just... Like, that, that, that's the problem with me, I have a guilt complex. Even if it's I'm not involved in something, I feel guilty about it. Aww. So the fact that Tori can't play Sea of Thieves because they get seasick, or is it motion sick? Oh, it's very I, fair. I can't do certain games if I can turn the feature off. That part. Can yeah, you I turn? Can. Yeah, you can't turn the swaying off, can you? You yeah, absolutely not. It's kind of part of the experience. Yeah, I'm physic yeah, I'm physically on a chip right now. They're swaying back and forth. Like, I don't I have no idea how you would, you know, do that. Unless a certain part of the ship might reduce the feeling of it. Uh, I doubt. Oh, I did hear something that there is recommend is recommended to do something in the settings. Uh, I think it's I think it's like the user i the user hood or something to switch up to ninety so you can see more. Oh. See more. The house is on fire. No mothers, just the more than lights. That's such a classic meme at this point. It's been so mean. I've definitely gone down a rabbit hole where that's all I've been watching for like a whole evening. Yeah. Just <laughs> steamed ham memes. Yeah. Rabbit hole. Score buddy. Ah. Don't catch me out, please. <laughs> I can't uh, get with that one. The days of watching Basil Brush. Boom boom. My mum right. hates me for breaking yeah. that up. Like my mum physically hates Basil Brush because she hates this catchphrase. Boom. Oh come on, just give me a yellow rabbit. <laughs> Dip it in some paint. I, I can't believe I remember that cash fire. It's, that has to be ingrained in me somewhere. I feel like I should put up a watch party and just put an episode of that on. No. That would get you copyright for sure. Not to stream. No, just for us, yeah. I feel like I would get bored quick though, so... <laughs> well. 
It's making me wonder if someone's put his, la his signature laugh onto the soundboard website oh, I use. Because if it did, be that'd be so funny. Tori, could you do that? Do a quick uh, search because like, I can't do it right now because I'm looking for stupid rabbits. I'm busy playing Sea of Thieves. That's why I'm asking Tori, not you. I am semi here. But you they should just said you're playing something and you can't do that. I'm allowed to have fun. Exactly. That's why I'm not asking you because you're busy. Right, search for a website called Blurp. B L E R P. That's the website where I get all the sounds for the chat. Oh god, you're gonna have to explain what Basil Brush is to the American. Oh no, that is <laughs> so very British. It's like a British children's television show with a puppet. It's a puppet fox and it was like, he acted like a comedian. So like, and then when you get there, go to the... Because I can't and... Here and, and um, Crowies are currently fighting for their life on the, the Seven Seas. And then when you get there, uh, put in the search engine Basil Brush. Basil like spice and brush like toothbrush. What a way That's to describe it. it. Mainly just to see if it works. And um, you'll know you've got the right sound when you hear like a laugh, Ooh. and then you end, and then it finishes with boom boom. That's gonna sound so wrong for them. British accent. Yeah, Basil Brush. I could just tell they're doing that really nervous laugh that they usually do for this. I'm hmm. nervous. I'm always nervous. Oh, I forgot to change the overlay. Did you? Yeah, I still got Mancino on here. I need to put Chimchar on there. Oh, good point. That's a brush. No. I don't think you want to have a look at that brush. No, <laughs> Basil brush. As in the spice. It's not herb. It's a herb. I thought it, I thought basil was a spice. Herb. Can you tell how uncultured we are because we're British. We just steal from every country. And then don't use any of it. That includes Basil. I'm confused.com. Oh my god, that's a good point. Do I need to call it Basil? Do, do, do I have to put an American accent on it for you to understand? Oh, right, yeah. Basil. basil. It, yeah, you, you guys call it Basil. It's really called I, Basil. No. <laughs> hey, I can barely hear you guys. No, you guys are fine. Right. Oh my God, was I'm on a phone call. That's why. Okay, that makes sense. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Leave it. It, it didn't matter. It We're didn't being matter. Very British. It's fine. And there we go. Chimchow's on this. Ah, what the hell's that? Thank you. Right, Chimchow's on the overlay. There he is. Oh, look at him. Cute little baby. I still find it weird that people actually like to eat rabbit. Well, that is also a British thing. Rabbit's not uncommon here. I think I might have shared to Tori's world then if they know that British people eat rabbit. And I know they like rabbits. I want to say that's actually fairly normal. 
Well, considering a part of this, the the US actually eat crocodile, so. It's actually true. Yeah, they actually eat crocodile. They do, don't they? Yeah. I think it's a Floridian thing. I thought it was New well, Orleans. Possibly, possibly other places do it as well, but I know Florida doing it. Yeah, like with alligators, they got Gator Alley. It took me so long to figure out why it was called Gator Alley. Oh, fair just, point. Just swap Gator and Alley together. Yeah, I've never been to America, and I don't know whether I want to, because it's just massive, and that frightens me. And big boom boom sticks that's legal. Yep. I still don't get why that's a thing. No, nobody does, Jay. We're British, I don't think we're ever going to understand the culture. I, uh, I'm, I'm never going to go near it with a 10 foot pole. Apparently, the stream was muted on Tori's oh, behalf. Oh, the stream was muted. No, it, it, the, the stream muted on Tori's bit. Apparently, we're fine here. Yeah, no, I know. I, no, Tori, it didn't matter. It was just messing around. No, yeah, we, we were just being very British. Don't worry about it. If anything, when you're next up on the call, I'll show you what we're talking about. <laughs> I will say, though, he's very funny. <laughs> we get a, we get a said weird clips to Tori. About a talking squirrel puppet. Oh, no, it was, it was a fox. Oh, That's damn, it is a fox. I'm sorry, it sometimes looks like a squirrel because it's quite small. Oh god, Tori just said, too late, handed over British people. <laughs> You're like the opposite of the British colonisation. Yeah, that is the opposite. But again, they stole the tea. And, and the no, tea is delicious. It. Yeah, they didn't, they didn't dump it in the river. That's untrue, they actually stole it. Historically, they stole tea. That is what happened. Yet they, um, yet they're more famous for drinking coffee. Yes. All right, all right. Our, our ancestors fought, but we don't have to, all right? Oh, well, there's a. Oh, here we go. I assume this will be okay. I mean, it's a children's show, so it should be fine. I got all seven. Yeah. The thing is, there's a joke I've got from that show that I know on the top of my head. Did you hear the fire at the campsite? The flames. We're intense. Ah, uh, so cheesy. <laughs> I'm finding that too funny. All the same, though, my mom really hated the show because of how much I repeated his catchphrase. The boom boom. I need to stop. It's it's stuck in my head. It's driving me nuts. To be fair. And that's why she hated it. I'm still waiting to see how they react. And it's going to be so out of context for everyone else. I, 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 I put it in the Discord, we'll see. It's going to be so out of context for people who don't know the conversation. Yep. Absolutely. Sometimes that's utterly hilarious, though. Why is my eye watering? Because you're teared up. With the conversation of a good boom boom. Out of context, that sounds so <laughs> wrong. <laughs> Tori's like, and you still lost the war. The, the war of depression. Yeah, it is true. No, actually, Jada, there was an actual war. I know there was a war. Do so. Yeah. Um, Well, I'm about to go fight a fortress because I found it, so... 
From what I've been told, fortresses are a good starting point for new players. Because like, they're easy enough, and they give good loot. Grindstone Fortress. I think if anything, that will be our first main target on the stream. Just focus on fortresses just to get us into a routine. That's true. And mainly just the gist of it. I'm currently dodging <laughs> tons of cabin fire. Oh, one got one hit me. Oh, there goes the mass. Ten minutes until the next stream raiders fight. What's kind of funny though about Basil Brush though is there was actually an American character called Madison and it was basically the biggest American stereotype the British broadcasting channel could oh, ever muster. Get away with And yes, she actually did say Basil's name as Basil. Which still sounds really weird in my eyes. <laughs> it's just Basil. I mean I had to say I had to say Basil to <laughs> to Tori for them to understand me. I shall see what their reaction is in a minute to I, I wouldn't be surprised if they're just gone unconscious just after watching like one hundred percent British tri t children's television. It's like a pineapple. If you eat a whole at once, you get poisoned. <laughs> Did you know that, actually? If you eat too much pineapple, citrus acid is that strong that it could actually... Well, poison you. Uh, good thing I don't like pineapple. Like, well, it crashed into the fortress. You might want to check for whole breaches. Yep, doing that now. Uh, I think we're mostly okay, it was just a tiny bit of water. Not that much, for once. Right, um... Yeah, I'm, <clears throat> I'm gonna say no. This is gonna get a bit bullshit, because I still haven't seen a single shiny score bunny. We are 1 hour and 13 minutes in stream. And still nothing? Exactly. Yeah. And it, it's not hard like Cyndaquil or Totodile has been. It's just, oh, I've just got to run into score bunnies. Well, time to fight for my life. Let's see what happens. If the flipping, if the flipping game worked, I'd be able to jump on and help you after this. Yeah, it won't, you know, put us together. Ow, I got shot. I am displeased. I am taking the chest. If anything, I'm getting more chimchars and score bunnies. And obviously that's something we don't need right now. Me, probably. Oh, there you are. Hmm. I think it's one thing with Tori trying to understand Basil Brush. It's gonna be another trying to see how the YouTube community reacts to us talking about him. problems I have with this game is not realizing where I'm being shot from. Hmm. I think the best way to put it is if someone's holding a gun, they did it. Yep. Useless when I can't tell what direction it comes from though. They conk her conke conquistador uh, phantoms. 
trying to survive, so far I'm not being shot anymore. Conquistadors? Wasn't that in the Spanish oh, main? Uh, yes. I'm trying to remember. Uh, yes, but I clearly have a slight bit of a lisp. A lisp? I've never noticed a lisp. I can't particularly say con con I stutter! It's not really a lisp, it's more that I stutter. I can't particularly say con con conquista the door very well. God! I have a hard time it's saying really abominable. Like, I really struggle with the word abominable. 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 I'm not being shot again. No. Stupid bunnies. These score bunnies are making you remember hop, and that is not a good thing. I did yeah, not. That film was on all the time when I was there. I did not like hop. I think it was just a really loud film. Ah, how well? We fail. Okay, this isn't gonna work. Apparently, we're the ones who lost the war, Tori, yet you haven't said anything for a bit. Powder barrel with tons of uh, phantoms shooting me. Probably a bad idea. Leave the gun barrel and run. You do not want to be near that barrel when it goes boom boom. Oh. Yeah, it it went off and it went off on my ship. That was a bad oh, idea. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. People have been advising barrel. never put gun barrels, like gun powder barrels, on your ship ever. And I mean that. And now you have just witnessed why. They give me money if I sell them. Not, but not much. I've only, I've been told they've only sell like for two hundred, and that's it. They're literally worthless. I'm, I'm, I'm greedy. You have not met greedy until you've faced Mike in Mario Party. I'm not joking on that one either. Point. At the end of the games, he's usually over a hundred coins. Cool. And his only bit of reasoning to it is he'll just say, I like the money! He'll say it that way too. Oh, my ship is on very much fire. Well, grab the water from the hole that's oh. probably leaking into and splash it onto the... absolutely leaking in, you're correct, well done. I'm also being shot, which isn't helpful. Why do I sound like an expert in this game when I've only been playing for like one and a half day? I suppose because you've been watching tons of content, which I haven't. I've been. I would actually recommend. Oh, why is there more fire? There, I would recommend one YouTube channel that my mom recommended me. And right. like their content is so good to watch in small bits or in one big go. Because like, they did their CFE video. Mm. Six hours long. They put all their Yay. vods. They put all their vods and put it into one video. I don't particularly want to be watching a six-hour-long video. But that's the point. You can watch it in tidbits. Fair. Like the, the channel's called Neebs Gaming. Okay. Thing is, <laughs> sadly, recently one of their members, Fic. Um, sadly passed away to cancer. Oh. So like, I think everyone's been incredibly supportive to them. And I have been as well. That's very sweet. I mean, hopefully the Sea of Thieves community will be. This is kind to us. Oh, they did their Sea of Thieves ga uh, game video like ages ago at this point. Like, what you see them do, like, has been, <clears throat> like, it's been a while. Uh, the more the more used to doing games like Seven Days to Die, Ark, Survival Evolved, 
This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Oh. Is that another silver? Oh, that's another a, shiny. That's another chimchar. Another chimchar. We don't need what monkeys. We need bunnies. Also, why is my bug type in front? Yeah, you came up from behind me. Good you. This is wasting time. Oh, a critical hit acrobatics? I thought we were playing D D. There are critical hits in Pokemon. So my brain always puts it like uh, you know in D and D terms. Ugh. If we find a, if we actually find a score, oh. so I may have fucked up in where people go and trade it. What is the fuck I can do about that one? Oh well. We'll just have to wait and see. We're waiting for the sandwich to finish and then we'll do it. But I need a shiny score bunny. It's a shiny I don't have yet altogether as well. Aha, our pouches. Helpful. I really need to find a way to de-stress. I really do. Well, you just need to find a good TV series, a good YouTube series, or something. That's what happened to the owl. Ha sure. That's what happened to the owl house. Why well, don't do TV series? Go and find something on YouTube. Um, I'm trying to think of something that I can recommend. Um, I recommend, I've been watching the Blades in the Dark gameplay, ta tabletop RPG for Ox Venture. I recommend that. Mm. Which episode is about an hour long? Is there a difference between an anxiety attack and a panic attack? Uh, no idea. What? I, I just really don't know. Yeah, that, I'm wondering about that. Anxiety, I feel like, is less serious, normal. Yeah, because panic attacks can oh, affect your panic. breathing, can't it? Yeah, panic attack, I want to say, it's a full mental shutdown, debatably. Problem yeah. is, that chimchar is at, that I just caught is at risk. If I don't find the score bunny, I'm gonna reset over it. That means I technically would lose a shiny. That is a problem. Again, this keeps happening. This just happens. Like and and you never get like the starters first time. Um, I would suggest to look at the Squirtle video. <laughs> oh no. No, I'll say, I won't say what happened. Just go and look. 
Okay. I should think about that later. So I am still in the middle of fighting phantoms. I don't know when it's meant to end. At this point, I think I should just call phantoms people who have not had coffee in the morning. Come on! Ugh. Sandwich is gone. No. What is the way about it? Uh, ignore that, that's the. Oh, what is not okay. a. What is, uh, what is happening? Hang on. For some reason, my, oh. mouse, my mouse is getting a really annoying bug where when I flip and switch over tabs. The mouse cursor disappears. Oh, weird. Well, that's the captain. That makes sense. And I've just lost all of my earphones, so I can't hear you. No, nope, I'm dead. Oh. Jeez, everything. <sighs> Sorry about that, and uh, ignore that. That is basically this the file I use for the gifts. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't see what you've done wrong here, Tori. Is that a football? It's a, f match? it's a, it's a football themed um, season. I do say football themed. <laughs> Go on and attack him. Once you finish that, I need to bring the grapple. And why did they take so long to move? They do, don't they? What's going on? I'm going to talk to him on fire. I'm facing them weirdly. So all the people in the middle are on defense. Oh, so we have to pick the roles? I don't, okay, we're British, we don't know how American football works. And you don't even use your feet! It's not football! That's it, get your British tendencies out. Soccer. My, attempt, my terrible attempt at an American accent. I apologize. When did I get him? <sighs> Looks like it's just gonna be one shiny this week. Hmm, yeah, but if you don't even get him because you have to cancel out after if you don't get the yeah, like, remember I found two. The first one's fine. Hmm. Excuse you, we do. Oh, we kick the goddamn thing. At oh yeah, at times. Oh, we do it, time. we do the kicking all the time. That's why it's called football. In that case, we might as well call it hand in football for you. Hand ball with occasional oh. feet action. How about this? For once every hour. How, how about this? How about we call it? Hand, foot, tackle ball. Because that's all you do. <laughs> okay, we're going to stop uh, this for a second and run an advert. I'm sorry, we're going to stop the argument and move on. Advert or, coming up. Or even better, we could call it rugby. That. Advert going. <laughs> Just wanted to get the final word in this conversation. <laughs> Before the advert... Turned on, yeah. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't think Tori would be the person that would be defending football, though. But aren't they the only American person in the group? Yeah. 
Actually, Joe kind of counts, but he wasn't a mod, so... There are some American members in the chat, so... There are, actually, to be fair. I will get in the call, I will have your ear dry. Uh-oh. Crowy? A bit of a PSA, you might want to turn down Tori's volume when they arrive. Oh no! I can't do that, Jay! I'm playing Steve Thieves. I will get in the call and you will have your ears removed, Jay. Tori, think of your Velo Fod. Croy would get caught in the crossfire if you did that. Hi. Sorry, to be fair, I've been equally inflammatory. Then why are you going Look after how, me then, because, Tori? Uh, because Jay's the streamer, we just automatically go for Jay. I got a bad feeling an emote's gonna happen in a few days. And it won't be one that I commissioned. Shameless plug. Yes, Tori is an amazing artist. This isn't absolutely going to make them cringe. Yes, of all the amazing artists I have ever come across, Da Vinci, uh, which was um, uh, Vincent Van Gogh. Uh, uh, Tori. Yes, right up there with the Renaissance. <laughs> and Crowey can turn me down on the end of the call, apparently. Yes, I can. Last, last uh, sandwich of the stream. Unless I find it really soon and then I'll get a chance to spin the wheel. I really like to spin the wheel, it adds adrenaline to my life. Ah! Dim. I'm just hoping that Tori gives some shiny rabbit luck with that anger towards. Wanna keep going, get how the name goes. The name game goes within the Americans against how British name their games. It's still making you cringe, so. Yay, I beat the fortress, I have the key. And I just gotta figure out where I put it. This should be like a this should be like a a cut like a, a small room at the top part of the the fortress. Yeah, I went to the top, it doesn't quite wanna unlock there. So apparently I have to go somewhere else. You are correct. Good. Maybe it, it, maybe you have to open somewhere else that will get you the proper key. That will get there first, yeah. Mm, let's try this. Ah, I found it. Open a sea fortune. I have an achievement. Da 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 da. You know what's weird? I keep hearing like Xbox sound effects when I'm playing Sea of Thieves. Yeah. But that's a bit weird. Especially since I'm not you're, even on a you're Xbox. On PlayStation. And you're on PC. Or oh, Steam Deck. I'm on Steam, yeah. <clears throat> uh, this stream is not sponsored by the Stream Deck. What do you mean sponsored by Steam? Yeah. Oh, cool. There is plenty of stuff in here. Where, where do I start? Where do I start? Oh. I do recommend that um, you put it so that the uh, chests are right where your harpoon can hit. So then you can pull them onto the ship that way. Pull them onto, yeah. I have to figure out where that is. Um. I actually am kind of terrified right now, knowing that Tori's going to come in any minute now. They might come in after the stream. That's what they want you to think. Oh, you're wide. 
I think it was mostly a threat, hopefully. Tori is not the sort of person that would bluff. But why haven't they turned up yet? I think it's to add tension. Mm, you're the one who's adding tension. Hey, if I was adding tension, I'd put a 24 star clock in the middle of the screen. So, I think you're definitely correct about the fortresses. I think maybe that might be a good first uh, thing to go for. Just, a, just at least to get us into the uh, routine of how sailing should work. Yeah. An important thing to note, though, is we're going to have to get into the routine of repeatedly looking in the horizon. The oh, sooner we find... Oh, the sooner we find out any threats, the better. Yeah. Because it... <clears throat> we also, we're going to have to work fast as well. thing is, there is a mindset you uh, people have been giving other people. If they see you, if you see them, they, they see, see you. you. So you... Might leave you alone. The important thing is to check the flags, because that could implement what they're trying... That what they're planning to do. Yeah, if they if they have a reaper flag, they're gonna kill. Yeah, if they have a reaper flag, we're fucking bolting it. We're running as fast as we can. But the thing is, those they reaper flags they make they make it so they show up on the on the map. So generically, we'll stay away from them. Yeah. Um, but the other thing with reapers is players can be reapers, can't they? Yes. In general, yeah, there are like whole entire factions that decide that that's their job. And it will be it. rough. Yeah. I mean, it's separate expansion, of course, there's going to be guilds that were going to do that. Sorry. How's my best channel artist? <laughs> Complimenting you won't save me, save me from you, Jay. Again, if it isn't gonna save me, it's gonna at least make it cringe. Which is the main reason why it's so funny. It's a running gag! Yes, it's it a good is. running gag. It's a running gag from the Minecraft days. Don't say it like that, it makes it sound like we've done it years ago. We did. We, the Minecraft stuff happened in 2023. Some of it started in 2022, for reference. Like, I've, I'm only just starting to edit the stuff from 2023. Only just now. It won't be long until we get into the new layout, then. Yeah. But we changed layouts quite often for a bit, so that's going to be fun for me to explain on in editing. Which, to oh. be fair... I don't prefer that. I prefer just having gameplay. That's why I've tried. That's why I've tried that um, layout I showed you earlier. Hmm. Cause um, how would you feel like doing the Sea of Thieves content, or do you want that to be left for me? Um, I have so much Minecraft content that I can't get through it quick enough. Um. But then again, I could do with a change, but it does mean the Minecraft content will be less often. Um, so it means I would have to flip between both Minecraft and, and Sea of Thieves. But the problem is it takes me so long to edit it. Um, and also because as time has gone on, my quality of editing has gotten better. And I'm taking more time in it, time in it because of it. It just takes so long. Um, and not to... Not to I was just checking about. Of anything, I was just checking out how you feel about it. Cause it I mean, you, I would do, but it's not going to be done any sooner. You know, if you want the videos out regularly, I'm not going to well, be done. My mindset was we were just going to upload the VODs fine, but then when you finish yeah. with Minecraft, then we work on Sea of Thieves. Jay, that's going to take me the rest of the year and more. Like, this isn't, I'm not finishing the Minecraft VODs anytime soon. I'm only, I've only gone up to the sixth stream. There were 30 of them. I did not, then we I did just, that many. 
Yeah, there are 30 streams. I am only at the 6 in editing. I will take care of Sea of Thieves. Um. That long. Yeah, I'll take care of Sea of Thieves. I'm disabled. I don't... I have no concentration. Don't worry. It gets very easily. Don't worry. I am intrigued though, Jay. Has my quality of editing gone up? Is it noticeable? I can see, yeah. Yeah. I think the if anything, the only thing I'd say that needs some looking into is like... The audio. Yeah, maybe yeah. just like find something copyright um, free we can stick to. We, mm, uh, there's a significant issue for that is you often use the... Um, Minecraft music are putting try to put other music on top of the Minecraft music at the same time is a nightmare. Well, it's not that loud, is it? Uh, Minecraft music. Yes. I, as in, Jay, I can't cut the Minecraft audio out. I know you can't. Way of doing it. So then you're gonna have two streams of music coming at the same time. You're gonna hear both, and it's gonna be weird. Okay, note to self, if I'm asking you to do a series, I need to actually turn off the audio. The music and stuff, yeah. Mm. It's, it's more that the problem is you can't really do this because of the way we stream with other people at times. Is mm. what, what you really need to do is you need the game audio and then you need the microphone audio separate. But we can't do that because we have friends. Yeah. And I can't get their audio separate. Because uh, they're, not, they're not recording, they're just playing. Yeah. And asking them to do that, it would be a nightmare. Um, I think the yeah. reason why the, it worked with Gartic Phone, because Gartic Phone doesn't come with any music. And well, you can switch it off. It does, but... I, I did. I did kind of get away with it when I when I do it with Overcooked, but that's generally because there isn't much sound. Yeah. Sounds in the game. But yeah, I, I I didn't remember Minecraft being that loud with its music. Can be. I definitely know one game that didn't need any help with that. I fire rush. Oof. Hmm. That game is just proving I've just got no rhythm. But don't play Necromerger. Not Necromerger, was it Dance of the... Dance of the Necrom... Dancer? Necrodancer? Is that what it's called? Yeah. I don't I don't know what it's called, but... Oh my god. I, I flipping Chimchar went past and it's the same shade of... <clears throat> colour that Score Bunny's ears are supposed to be. So close and yet so far. No, it's just so far. So it's just so far. So far. In the end, it doesn't even matter. It feels like it doesn't. Mm. Just give me a stupid bunny. Did it get everything? Nope, there's one more thing there. Nope, I'm gonna have to do that by hand, it's too small. I'm going to make a movie reference and it's going to make so much sense. It's quiet. Too quiet. Too quiet. What's that from again? Remind me? It rings a bell. I want to say Shrek, but I think that copied it for someone. Yeah, I want to say it's a reference to like a World War Two film or something. Saving Private Ryan? Maybe. Possible. I'm not good with films, I don't watch a lot of them. 
I'm not sure if it makes sense to say, but I have realized like the hype of watching a film kind of goes away for some reason. Yeah. Like obviously I'll go and see a film. Like believe me, when me and Mike went to go and see the Mario film, it was the Mario film that was amazing. And like we did the same thing with um that Spider Man Across the Spider Verse film. That was an amazing film to watch. I watched the first one in cinemas. That was very good. Um, problem is, I don't particularly like this watching films in cinemas because it's loud. Yeah, that was one thing I was wondering before. actually. Do you struggle with that? Yeah, definitely. I'm very sound sensitive. Well, um, there is something actually. Um, I think there is an autistic friendly cinema screening these days that turns yeah, it down. They're always at stupid o'clock in the morning when I'm not awake. Well, um, I think the story I, house yeah, is alright. I, I, I can't travel. I also have the issue of I can't get anywhere. Hmm. No, 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 come on! 15 minutes. So the only thing we're going to be getting out of this week is a stupid monkey. Not that Jim Chow's stupid, it's just... Hey, hey, look, look. Two score bunnies, and then look how many Jim Chows there are. Yeah. <sighs> so it's, close. It's monkey democracy. It's a player of the Apes film. Planet of the Apes? Planet of the Apes was a good set of films. It Not be. the originals. I mean, the originals are weird, but... The, uh, the originals, you know, the originals yeah. creep me out. It's just people in monkey yeah. suits. I mean, the makeup was significant for the time period. Yeah, but that's basically saying that dinosaur was the best cinematic experience of all time, and it's dinosaur. <laughs> yeah, definitely not. A dinosaur that had all of the terrible sequels. You mean the Land Before Time? Oh, Land Before Time. There you go. And why? Why? Why did my brain put the two of those together? I was Maybe. talking about the film that Disney made. That sh shit CGI. Yeah. And actually used real fire okay, PNGs but, for, a, for an explosion. But to be fair, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> the same could be said for Land Before Time. Yeah, no, no, the Land Before Time are great animation. Yeah. Within reason. Have you seen any of the sequels? I'm allergic to it's, it's direct to DVD sequels. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like Toy Story is one of the only film series that every film has been pretty okay. <coughs> Lightyear! Oh, good point, there is Lightyear. Oh no. That's a TV series though, I'm talking films. No, Lightyear it's was a proper film. It's a film? I thought it was a TV series. Well, you didn't, you yeah, didn't see about time. the, you didn't hear about the proper one called Lightyear. Like, it was made back in 2022. Yeah, but I thought it was a TV series, because the second no. you play on a streaming service, my brain was just like, Oh, it's gotta be a TV series, but no, they put films on streaming services now, don't they? Duh. I'm so behind. One, can you tell I don't subscribe to anything? Uh, two, can you tell I don't watch films? Three, can you tell I don't watch TV series? Because I do not like getting my hopes up. That's what people got for uh, messing around with Game of Thrones. <laughs> this is true. Hey, all every season was fine until the last. To me, all all that show was was just how to train your dragon with death and sex. Point. I had well, I don't know. I'm sorry. How to train your dragon is very different. I do I have to say though, I I I nearly burst into tears at the end of the third one. 
Oh, I haven't seen it. I think I've only seen the first one and a bit of the TV series years ago. You still haven't watched the before. second one? No, because it... All right, here's the thing. This is a problem with me and sequels. If the first one's a good film, I don't want to see the second because I don't want the first one being ruined. I'll say this now. The second one is just as good, if not better. Really? I'm not joking. Like, people have been saying the second one's the better one. I should take that as adver ad ad not advertisement, as advers help. Think of it as a compare. Think of it like what happened with the Shreks. Like, yeah, everyone likes Shrek, but everyone says that Shrek 2 is the better film. Oh, I agree. I love Shrek 2. It's That's like a good point. That's a good one. Good point. You got me there. I will give you that. I think it's the same situation with the Kung Fu Panda series. Man, DreamWorks do so good with second films. Well, maybe not with Madagascar 2. Maybe not Madagascar 2. I liked Madagascar 3, though. Hang on. Please don't tell me this is a ship. I'm sorry! No, I think it's a Meg. What is it? Something's coming for me. I have booty! Leave me alone! Oh, fuck off. Careful where you swing oh. the booty. Mine. I deserve it. I want to go home. I am I am a mature adult. I will not laugh at the word booty. Yeah, it's mostly just because I couldn't find the word for treasure. Men it's because it's something that men like to touch. Okay. What were we saying about the James Bond stuff earlier? Bond's names, James names. Pleasure to, what? I am James names. James name having a James Strunk call of bondulence. That one is such a great name. It is. A good favourite. Uh, I need to go west. Where's Northwest for the minute. Not into the Meg. I'm gonna have such a laugh talking to Meg about this. Like, hey Meg, why'd you keep attacking Crowy? Well, what are you talking about? She, well, they kept saying they were being attacked by a Meg. I swear, if I bump into another fucking chimcha, I've got to, I've got to read the message. I keep missing. Despite it being gigantic. Why is it easier for me to hit ships for some reason? Well, ships are very vulnerable to yeah, cannonballs. Yeah. Hard right, hard right, we're gonna crash. You're the only person on the ship, you're talking to yourself there. I know I am. I'm just reminding me what I have to do. Um... I'm not liking how Tori's been quiet the entire time after saying no. that. Hi God, have they been in- I'm just curious of whether they've been in the Discord the entire time listening to us. No, no, they're not here. So oh, they're not, they haven't been spying. I wouldn't- I would have been able to see on my end as well, so... But it's just the fact that I can see that someone is there and I know it's them. Good point. Anchor. They're just the sitting car. there, menacingly. Right, I'm not gonna go check that my uh, chip isn't. Uh, magically, I did not get hit by the megalodon at all during any of that. From what I've been told, the work. from what I've seen, the meg is kind of the easiest thing to deal with. Just make sure it knows to stay away, and then if not, you've just got a bunch of shark meat. Yeah. Like I dealt with a Meg earlier, like I just shot it a bunch of times and tried to attack but then it decided to just leave. I have killed one before, no actually I haven't. I might have told it to go away before. <laughs> I think it's gonna listen. I've killed, I scuttled a few ships. 
Okay, the amount of squirrel bunnies here and still nothing. We are almost five minutes to the next hour. So well, we're this, almost is, hours. this has still got seven minutes, so either way. Yeah, yeah. I wanted to spin the wheel, but now we can't. No, you can't actually, can you? Hmm. Uh oh. I... This, this, so I'm sorry, this is the curse of the starters again. Again, just We've look. Got um, again, again, look at Squirtle. Okay. That leg is lurking, despite the fact that I'm in port. Luckily, I'm in well, port, I didn't want to touch me. That is one thing sharks are known to do. Just, just the music keeps coming back occasionally. Shame they don't have the licensing to do the Jaws theme. Okay, a big. Yeah, I'm surprised they haven't had like a Jaws tall tale. You know, you'd That's... think that would go really well. Yeah, they've done Monkey Island and Pirates of the Caribbean. Yes, it's uh, Caribbean, yeah. not Caribbean. Well, I mean. That's what the film is, but I think the place is actually called the Caribbean. Then why do we say the we're Caribbean? British. Because we're British and we're idiots. And we, and we stole everything from there. And that's just, just what we decided to name it. Actually, the Spanish were known to steal from the Caribbean more. I'm sure we had some part of it. I, I, I just assume whenever anyone talks about colonization, I just go, yeah, British, of course. The thing is, there is a there is a dark there is a dark theory from all the um, Paldea starters about what their theming is. The theming is colonization. Hey. Right, welcome here. Right, Masquerade is obviously based on mas masquerade balls. And they originated from New Orleans, right? Um, France, to be fair, but yes. Well, New Orleans has French uh, aspects into it. Yeah, with the French that came to settle there. New Orleans um, was a part of America that Spain invaded. Skeledurge. Mm -hmm. It's based on the Day of the Dead in Mexico. Mexico is the one yeah. country in the world known to be taken over by Spain, hence why they speak Spanish. I mean, there were places in America that were taken over by the Spanish. I'm sure there were also other countries, but whether, you know, they completely colonized the area is debatable. And Quaquavel um, is obviously based on Brazil. And this is no joke. It's the reason why it's got a dump truck. Oh, you keep... This, this keeps being mentioned, yes. Yeah. Quaquavel is based on a Carnaval Brazil dancer. Yes. And Brazil was invaded by Spain. Or more specifically, the Iberian Peninsula. Jay, I have so many chests from that last, like, fortress raid. The fortresses are definitely going to be a good idea to go for. Agreed. And also since we're going we're gonna to want to buy that galleon. You're gonna have to somehow convince Mike to jump on for a bit of practice. How long did you two play after I left yesterday? We didn't. We left immediately. He wasn't interested. That's why we need to convince him. Yeah, to, to, to be... Bob... Words. I... Mm. Okay, the area number... Why is, whenever, why is it whenever I try and communicate, I can no longer find the words for what I need to say? Yes. Uh, Jay, there's no point because it's not gonna gonna get not gonna get any better until the twenty fifth. No, I don't mean trying again for that. I mean like just get Mike to play so we can practice. I have no idea how to convince him to do that. Me neither. It's gonna be his own problem. Alright, but if he starts complaining at me when I tell him how to do this or that he literally has no way to no no um like position to push, does he? No. But he 
he's welcome to do what he wants to do. Jeez, I wish it was easier ferrying things to and fro, but it's not. It's annoying. I think that's why it's recommended to play with someone. Yeah, but doesn't someone always need to stay on the ship to defend it? No. Tori, we are still looking for the bunny. Wait two minutes, please. In all fairness, it does mean the editing won't be won't be as harsh today. Because nothing much happened. Exactly. You got you got the monkey. I got the monkey. Before I found a third one then. I might have to consider trying to roll for an outbreak for this thing. Next week. Mm. And yeah, Tori, you're gonna be joining the chat after the stream, aren't you? Oh, definitely. You're welcome to. Yeah, we could welcome the communicationing. Even though our communicationing is broken. Under a minute to go. They, they were in a call with other people, so yeah. they might also be busy. Yeah, I can think about it, yeah. Is the idea open to do a D and D session in our group? Yeah, we've talked about it before, it's just finding a date. Um, and also, I don't think Tori is available at the moment. Well, I'm not wasn't saying that. Agreed, wasn't it agreed that Tori was the DM? I don't know who has okay. decided to be the DM. I'm definitely not doing it. Ten seconds, come on, any score bunny. Come on, come on, come on. Any like a paint of being yellow. And we're fucked. Oh. You are the most evil thing on the planet. <laughs> you didn't do it. Too bad. I can be the DM if you guys want to try playing D&D. We all just need to talk about a day and a time that we can try for one shot of sorts. Yeah, I was going to say one shot rather than any particular campaign. Because I, I just don't have the time. Are there any, um... What's it called, um... Uh, what's it called, what's it called, what's it called? Storylines that can be a one shot session. Well, it's all homebrew, Jay. Yeah? You, you pretty much homebrew anything. Um, technically, but it'd be very railroaded and it, you know, it's difficult to do. I mean, D and is one of those ones where you can pick up and play anything. So it depends what direction we want to go. I'm only used to playing, well, not long campaigns, but longer campaigns. I forgot how old Stream Raiders is. And not, not Stream Raiders, D&D. Oh, does he? I don't know if it's even since the 80s. It might be before the 80s. I don't remember, it's quite old. I have no idea how to explain D&D to a person who, you know, has never played before. I kind of have, but it was weird because randomly I got 
some kind of curse that made me 50 years younger or something. Uh, 50 years older or something. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> Welcome to D&D, &D, that happens. I'm so confused. Yeah, you're meant to care about your character and also they're now an old man. I was like, what? I still don't get it. Right, alright. So, that will be it for today. But, as you have seen today, I despise wabbits. At least the monkey was happy for me today. So yeah, um, that'll be it for today. Uh, if you like the content, please consider liking and subscribing. We've made good progress recently, and we're hoping to keep the momentum up. And yeah, um, as you know, we've been trying extra hard to try and figure out how um, Sea of Thieves will work out. We mostly have an idea, and our first Sea of Thieves stream will be happening on the 26th of April. Don't be late. I'll probably put something up on the uh, video board for, for that. But yeah, thank you for watching, I'll see you guys soon. See ya.